is up obscure mic people yes my video looks a little weird little off color there's a reason for that though today I'm gonna check out something that Samson sent me over and that is the brand new go mic video a USB microphone it's basically the go mic but with a camera built in camera built in 1080p condenser this should be fun now for the sake of knowing i decided just to do a one for one test here i am using the razer kayo webcam built-in ring light but i do have other lighting in here so that's what you're seeing right now is the razer kayo and that should be what you're hearing right now as well is the razer kayo now this thing typically costs about a hundred bucks. I think the price has come down recently, but uh, I do also have the Razer Kayo Pro. In my experience, those cameras, the Kayo and Kayo Pro, very similar. So we're gonna test uh, the sound, the picture, the whole nine yards. This is about a foot and a half away from me right now. Foot and a half to almost two feet away from me. The camera, the mic source, two feet away. Let's go ahead and uh, show you what all comes in the box on this, and then we'll wire it up. In the Samson box, we are going to get the microphone, of course, documentation, USB-C to C, and on the microphone, of course, same style as the Video Go mic, but it is a little bigger than the original Go mic little bigger, little wider, little taller. There's the camera. Here's your clip. Got your threading to thread to a camera mount or a stand or a selfie stick or whatever you want to use. You've got USB-C. That's very welcome. A 3.5 millimeter jack. And of course, just like the Go mic, we've got omnidirectional or a cardioid pattern, which is switchable got the silver front black back also reminiscent of the first go mic and yeah that's what $99 gets you right there and now we have the Samson go mic video this is what that looks like in comparison running straight into my computer uh, most auto features turned off uh, with the auto features on the white balance was super out of whack but that's on this computer uh, my computer at work, it was absolutely beautiful. So I don't know if that's a difference between, you know, computers or what. But this is the picture you can expect to get. And the sound you can expect to get from the Samson Go Mic video. Now, that being said, my computer is emitting some wicked fan noise. So if you hear some noise, it's not the mic. It is the fan in the computer. But this is what the Samson Go Mic video looks like and sounds like in comparison to the Razer Kyo Pro that I've got right here with the ring light built in. But yeah, I think that the Samson Go Mic video is extremely workable, more natural. The colors are, uh, I didn't really adjust the colors, just the white balance. And the colors look pretty good. I think if you're just wanting to roll with like a one mic one video setup to do some youtube stuff i mean if you're not concerned with top-notch audio because i am sitting a foot and a half to two feet away from the microphone but it is nice that i am talking directly into the microphone at the same time and getting the video quality that i'm getting which is pretty good not perfect but i mean it is a webcam but this is probably one of the better webcams I don't have a good side, that's for sure. But this is one of the better webcams I've used. I actually think that I prefer it over the Razer Kayo and Kayo Pro. Not to mention, it has an actual condenser capsule built in, so that audio pickup is just going to be a lot better, at least in my eyes and in my ears. Let's go ahead and I'll get closer to the mic. Uh, but before I do that, we'll go ahead and switch out of cardioid mode and we'll go to omnidirectional. Okay, so now we're on omnidirectional. So this is probably going to pick up even more fan noise around the mic. Pick up more reverb and background noise. But again, 
I actually can't hear it, but you know what? I should hear it because it does. We do have latency free monitoring here, so I'm not sure why I'm not using that. Me and my very unscientific, I know why, because it's probably going to drag down my picture a little bit, maybe. There we go. The fan noise is really picking up now, so I'm sure that omnidirectional is picking up a lot. Again, we do have latency free monitoring, so you can monitor the audio you're recording. Let's go back to cardioid. Let's go ahead and I'll get the mic closer to me to test like close miking with this if you want to use it as a actual microphone and not so much for the video aspect of it, which defeats a little bit of the purpose, but we'll we'll treat it more like a microphone here. All right, so if you do want to use the Go mic video as more of a microphone, this is what it's going to sound like when you're close to it. Have it at an angle, not trying to throw some plosives right in there. But this is, uh, this is what that's going to sound like when you're using the Go mic video as just a microphone. So at the end of the day, I think as an all-in-one microphone and video solution, just for some quick and easy YouTubing, maybe a video podcast, this works pretty well. And you've got that latency-free monitoring, and you're going to get that computer playback as well. So this is great for interviews and such. I, I think it's a really good product. At $99, I think it's priced pretty much just right. I wouldn't want to pay like $150 or more, but for $99 to have a webcam, a microphone, kind of do with it as you will, use it as a mic out and about, use it as your webcam and microphone solution, I think for, uh, you know, people that just want to get started but aren't big audio people and aren't big video people this will this will get your youtube channel started this will get your video podcast started this will get your zoom call started for sure i think it's a pretty cool option i do appreciate samson samson for sending it over uh on the bb sar i'm actually going to give this one a score of an eight i think it's a great purchase for the first time YouTube channel maker, Zoom caller, all of the above that I said before. I think it's actually a really cool solution. Looks good, highly portable, stick it in your pocket. The one thing, the one thing I wish this would have came with was that cool little zipper pouch that the original Samson Go mic came with. I love that thing. I throw that thing in my pocket. Just not sure why. I don't use it very often, but it's easy to throw in your pocket and just go. And with this being USB-C and almost all devices converting to USB-C these days, you're bound to find a cable somewhere. I love this as a portable travel device or for a, a laptop that doesn't have a good webcam. Good times, good stuff. Mark's out of here. Obscure mics. Peace out.